What up, what up? Slime TV first edition, man. And uh, I'm your host, Big Blue Gambino. You know what I'm saying? And uh, we gonna get in right into it. We just gonna hop right on into it, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm pretty sure most of y'all out there watched uh, the BET Hip Hop Awards 2011 last night. You know what I'm saying? Real good stuff, real good stuff. Uh, everybody was blowing Twitter up, blowing Facebook up about the ciphers. You know what I'm saying? Uh, who out there had the best cipher? You know what I'm saying? That That's what... What everybody was wondering, you know, everybody had their picks, you know what I'm saying? The uh, the uh, the, the skills one with skills, Lady of Rage, uh, you know, Maybach Music had theirs. Uh, my personal favorite was was the Shady 2.0, and uh, just to see them dudes rip the way they did, you know what I'm saying? And, and those dudes, Yellow Wolf. Uh, Slaughterhouse, you know, Joe Buttons, Joy, Ortiz, Royster 59, and my boy Crooked Eye from the West Coast. You know what I'm saying? Those dudes, they don't even get the, the play that they deserve. You know what I'm saying? And to come out there and show and prove like that, it's crazy. So, you know what I'm saying? My, my best cipher award goes to the Shady 2.0. You know what I'm saying? Um. Let me know who who y'all, you know what I'm saying, who y'all pick as, as far as the best cipher. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can hit me up on Twitter, you know what I'm saying, uh, Blue Gambino, or you can hit me up on Facebook, also Blue Gambino. Um, what else I liked about the BET Hip Hop Awards? You had uh, the return of T.I. and DMX, you know what I'm saying? Me personally, T.I. is one of my favorite rappers, you know what I'm saying? I, I remember... When he, you know what I'm saying, when he was first doing it back in, uh, I want to say, 97, 98, I think it was when I first heard him on the, uh, it was the uh, the uh, Shaft soundtrack with Benny Siegel. Crazy, you know what I'm saying? So just to, just to see that the king is back home and doing this thing, you know what I'm saying? Hats off the tip, you know what I'm saying? Uh, X. I like that X came out there and hit y'all with, with that nostalgic, that old school Rough Riders. You know what I'm saying? And that sound is missing in today's hip hop. Uh, I don't, you know, it's a lot of funny style niggas out there right now. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't going to say that I'm hating on the skinny jeans and all that. But some of y'all dudes, real funny style, man. So, uh. I had liked that just to see, you know what I'm saying, just to see that. Matter of fact, I had like the whole nostalgic part of, you know, the BT Hip Hop Awards bringing Heavy D out, honoring LL Cool J, the GOAT, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's just, those are good looks, things that, that, that a lot of young people don't even know about, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people was, was on Twitter. Talking about Heavy D like, you know what I'm saying, like he was lame. You know what I'm saying? Heavy D invented that that fat lane. A lot of, you know what I'm saying, Rick Ross wouldn't be hot right now if it wasn't for Heavy D. Biggie wouldn't be where he was if it wasn't for Heavy D. You know what I'm saying? And he come out there dancing and stuff. I remember when hip-hop was about rapping and dancing. You know what I'm saying? You actually put on a show at a, at a, at a show. You know what I'm saying? Big Daddy Kane came out there with, with Scoob and Scrap and was, was dancing. You know what I'm saying? Heavy D came out there with the boys and was dancing. MC Hammer, all that. You know what I'm saying? So, like that. Big big ups to all that. You know what I'm saying? That shit was hot. That shit was hot. Uh, uh, people was asking me who I would like to see in the ciphers. Uh, I ain't got no particular person, but maybe a certain theme for, I don't know, next year or whatever. Maybe they should do an old school cipher. Or, 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 you know what I'm saying, how they had different crews and everything. Maybe they should have a separate, a uh, old school crew, like, you know what I'm saying, like a Big Daddy Kane, Rakim, uh, KRS-One, and, and let them dudes rock in the cypher, you know what I'm saying, to to show that they still that, that they still got it, you know what I'm saying. Or or maybe they could do a West Coast cypher and then an East Coast cypher, not, not on no beef stuff, you know, just different regions, West Coast. East Coast, down South, Midwest, whatever. You know what I'm saying? I think that'll be a good look. Um, you know, so <clears throat> excuse me. That's that's was uh what I had liked about the BET Awards. Um, 
one thing that that the BT Awards it seemed like that it uh it showed was the different crews right now that's winning in in hip hop or or that can win in hip hop. You know what I'm saying? You got MMG Ross is I don't know. He's like a right now as far as marketing and getting the right people surrounding himself with the right people. He he a genius. You know what I'm saying? Him starting off humbly from you know the slip and slide days. You know what I'm saying? To to where he at right now? Much respect to Ross. You know what I'm saying? I mean he put together a, a killer crew. Meek Mills out of Philly. Wale out of DMV, Stiley out of Ohio, you got my boy Pills out of GA, you know what I'm saying? Zone 6 stand up. Uh just his even even now uh, his old crew that uh you know gunplay, Don Logan, which I think he should get a little bit more shine, you know what I'm saying? But he killing it right now with what he got going on, you know what I'm saying? So that's that's what's up. MMG, you got Shady. Or or what he dubbing it now with the Shady 2.0, you know what I'm saying? And uh, they out murking, you know what I'm saying? M, best rapper alive right now. I don't know about the dude with the dreads and skinny jeans or what he talking about, but M right now, hands down, is, is killing the scene. And, and y'all seen it from the cypher, man. Slaughterhouse, Yellow Wolf, D12, uh just just smashing on stuff, you know what I'm saying? Uh and then you got you got the young money, cash money, and you know what I'm saying? They they got a solid movement, but I don't I don't see it lasting too long as as far as my personal opinion. You know what I'm saying? I think sooner or later you got your core people going to get shined and then everybody else going to start disbanding, you know what I'm saying? Uh you got you got the Wayne, you got Drake you got Nikki, you know what I'm saying, Birdman, and then everybody else is just they just fell with the friends from what I from from what it seemed to me, you know that crew ain't ain't too solid to me, you know what I'm saying, but that's just my opinion, you know what I'm saying. So, Hip Hop Awards show last night was was dope. I like what it did, you know what I'm saying. So shout out to BT. I think that to me was maybe the best put together award show that they did, and you know they done had a lot of bummy. Four shows lately, so just for that to happen and to come together like that, it was clean. It was nice. Uh, let's get into the news, man. Uh, you know what I'm saying? What's, what's popping off in, in hip-hop news? Bootsy is still in jail. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He's still there. Uh, I get on Twitter a lot, and I see a lot of people bigging up Bootsy. And big up Bootsy. You know what I'm saying? I dig his music. Dude, dude was doing it, but... For the stupid shit that he did, that's where you end up. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people are in free bootsy. Quit with that dumb shit. Why free boots? The nigga, the nigga put a hit out on somebody else and got caught. You know what I'm saying? So stay bootsy. Stay where you at, man. Do your time. I mean, keep your head up. Do your time. And hopefully you get out in time. But it's unlikely. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, uh. Lil Wayne did a 30-minute PSA. Hmm. Why? For what? You know what I'm saying? Why? So, I'm going to just keep moving on from that. Uh, the Lupe, uh, last night, you know, he came out there, did his, his thing on the uh, award show. And everybody was probably wondering who, you know... Who's that chick back there singing in the burka like that? You know what I'm saying? Come to find out it was Erica Badu in the burka. <laughs> Everybody know Erica Badu. Something. She's whatever she's smoking or whatever is great. Her creativity is, is off the meter. And when she get with certain people, it seems to transform their creativity. You know, three stacks, common, uh, J Electronica, uh, more recently, the doc is crazy. So, shout out to Erica Badu and her burka. You know what I'm saying? I wonder if she was naked up under that burka. <laughs> uh, my thing, Estelle, which I seen in the cypher last night, was crazy, phenomenal. She spit harder than a lot of the dudes who a lot of people was checking for in the cypher. And for her to be a R and b singer from out the UK, not saying that the UK, you know what I'm saying, Ain't ain't about it, but 
it was just crazy to see her spit like that. So Estelle, props to you, baby. You know what I'm saying? You did your thing last night. You showed that you can hold your own in, in you know what I'm saying, in the male dominated world of hip hop. So you know what I'm saying? Shouts out to you. Uh and and local news, at least, you know what I'm saying, local from where I'm from, two two nine R Benny stand up. The homie locale is home. He did his bid, he did his stretch, he's back home, salute the locale, crime house, you know what I'm saying, J-Bo, uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, yeah, I, I, I hope y'all boys get back to work, put out that good music, the city needs it, you know what I'm saying, the world needs it, so locale, I know you got something to say, you been in there right, and I know you been in there just putting together some, some crazy shit, so, big up to you, man, and, 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 uh, Holla at me. Let's, let's do some work. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> All right. Now, before I go, because you know what I'm saying, I ain't, it's my first edition Slum TV. Just, you know, a little test run, see how many hits I get or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, I keep pushing this thing every week. That's what I'm going to try to do. But uh, before I go, let me let me um do do a couple releases that just came or just either is coming out. Or, or just came out, you know what I'm saying, from some of the people who run in my circle or, or who I just like that, you know what I'm saying, listen to. Uh, Vinny Dapper Dunn, the homie Vinny, you know what I'm saying, big up to him, 3045 TV, what's up, you know what I'm saying, that's why I get this this whole video blog thing from anyway, Dr. Sam Beckett, shouts out to you, man. Uh, Vinny Dapper Dunn's V-Day, it drops 10-15-11. You know what I'm saying? Which is Saturday. He's having a release party. Hopefully everybody can show up. It's going down. It's going to be crazy. Al Pete's going to be spinning. You know what I'm saying? Shouts out to DJ Al Pete. Uh, V-Day. Vinny Dapper Dunn. 10, 15, 11. That's coming. Uh, click Music. Yeah, Click Music. Y'all know all Benny stand up. They just put out their mixtape working. It's on that piff right now. So... Go and cop that. That's real good. I listened to it. As soon as it came out, I listened to it all day. You know what I'm saying? Just to make sure it was it was that that good shit. So shout out to that boy Tweezy, Big Josh, you know what I'm saying? Play uh player G. All them boys, you know what I'm saying, doing the hard click music. Um good one. I like that. Good mixtape, homie. Uh The Freedom Fighters. Uh I, I haven't got the uh, official releases on on the stuff they doing. I know they was just up at the A three C, uh, doing it doing it real big. So uh, shout out to Money Carlo and all them boys, all the free to fighters. You know what I'm saying? Fist high. Uh, do your thing. Uh, y'all holler at me, man. You know what I'm saying? Let me get some of y'all stuff so I can put it out here on the blog on the vlog. I should say, and get y'all release dates out there. Uh, my shit drop. Blue Gambino. Still stranded on death row, you know what I'm saying? It's on that piff. Uh, having a, a problem on my other server that I had uh, uploaded the mixtape up on. Uh, uh, it's doing pretty good, you know what I'm saying? 115 downloads, 500 listens. Uh, you know, just trying to trying to push it, and it's free music, people. You know what I'm saying? So if you supporting, if if you support good music and you support uh, local talent, or you just support talent regardless go out and download some of this stuff listen to it man you know what i'm saying and, and if they are if 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 they are giving it to you to purchase purchase it you know what i'm saying if you can go out and purchase lil wayne why you can't go out and purchase the homie down the block who's trying to get to that lil wayne's level you know what i'm saying so my shit still stranded on death row that piff v-day dropping uh it's i think it's gonna be available on itunes click music Working, it's on that piff. The Freedom Fighters. If y'all see them in the streets, I've been in two two nine at Southwest Georgia. Y'all holler at them. Tell them, hey, let me get a CD. Run up the Monte Carlo. Hey, you got anything on you? Let me get that right now. I'm pretty sure he handed it to you. You know what I'm saying? It's it's nothing. So uh uh oh, the homie A list, the big homie A list. He dropped his. Uh, I want to say it's called Villains. He dropped his a couple weeks ago. I'm on it. The whole BCG click, and we is smashing. We crazy right now. It's on it, so be on the lookout for that. Be on the lookout for the BCG album coming. Uh, so, first edition, Slum TV. I got Beavers and Butthead about to drop with me and my brother. You know what I'm saying? 
I'm coming out hard with another one. So let's get it, man. Big Blue Slum TV signing off. Let's go. Let's jump over and let me low line stands can't score on us. Hunt around drop for the 8K nigga. So one more step, this thing gon' bust. Yeah, gotta protect our nuts. Let's go swag with a doomsday punch. Early murder, murder, getting ready for brunch. Every bitch I know with my